I think that uh, if you have a death penalty at all, uh, that that is a case where you're massacring those students with premeditation uh, and utter disregard for basic humanity, that you deserve the death penalty. And so the jurors came back. It, apparently, it was 11 to 1 with one holdout refusing to authorize uh, the ultimate punishment. And that means that uh, this killer is going to end up uh, getting a same sentence of people who've committed bad acts, but acts that did not rise to this level. I just don't think anything else is appropriate uh, except a capital sentence in this case. And so I was very disappointed to see that. I'm also disappointed that we're four and a half years after these killings, and we're just now getting this. You know, they used to do this. He would have been executed in six months. He's guilty. Everybody knew that from the beginning. And yet it takes years and years in this legal system that is not serving the interests of victims.